speaking of being unserious, um, here's another another example. Not just in the government, but also in media. So the View, you know, if you if you tune into the View, whoever makes the mistake of doing that, um, maybe I, I don't know. I don't know what you're expecting when it comes to something like this. I don't know if you're expecting in real insight into uh, into geopolitics from the ladies of the View. But if that's what you're looking for, you're going to be disappointed. Um, here is Joy Behar. What, what's what's her main you know concern? What what is she worried might happen if this um, if this conflict spreads and becomes a world war? Yeah, there's global warming, but as far as she's concerned, there's um, a consequence even more dire than that. Listen, estimates are fifty thousand Ukrainians mm. will be dead or wounded, yeah. and that this is going to start a humanitarian crisis, a refugee crisis in Europe. We're talking yeah. about five million people yeah. that that are going to be displaced. Yeah. I mean. It's it's heartbreaking to hear what is going to happen. Yeah. Well, I'm scared of what's going to happen in, in Western Europe, too. Yeah. Huh. You know, you just you plan a trip. You want to go there. I want to go to Italy for four years. I haven't been able to make it because of of uh, the pandemic. And now this, you know, it's, yeah. it's like who's going to what's going to happen there. And now this. First, there was a pandemic of five million people died and it stopped me from taking it, my, my Italy vacation that I've wanted to take. It's been my dream. And now we have war. What else? What else is going to happen to me as Joy Behar? So I, I think um, some some very compelling arguments have been presented to Putin. And hopefully he's paying attention because, listen, you got to stop this. Because if you don't, it's going to kill more polar bears from global warming. And if that's not enough to persuade you, Mr. President, then also you're preventing Joy Behar from going on an Italian vacation that, by the way, she's wanted to take for four years. We'll have to see. We'll have to see if that if that does the trick. Well, I hope you enjoyed that clip from the Matt Wall Show. If you did, go ahead and hit that subscribe button right down there so you can stay up to date on all of our future content.